Uh, I don't know. I've been in two, and it was everybody has their different bonds. But as an offensive lineman, you spend so much time together. You're trying to build those relationships. So the trust is half the battle in the games. You got to trust the guy beside you. So we do multiple things to get together, spend time together, so we are um, like one out there. Right. Um, yeah, they got talent over here. Most D lines in the league are very gifted, very talented. But they have guys who've led both of them that've led the league in sacks with JJ and Chandler. So they have experienced guys over there, and they have some young guys who are playing really hard. They got two linebackers, really fast guys. So they have they put some pieces together, and it's going to be a good game. For you as a guy, like you got identified up front, the number change. Does that like have any impact? What's your your thought process? Yeah. Um. You have to. Going in Mondays and Tuesdays, you really got to learn the personnel, know who's going to be in the game. It's not just, oh, oh, he's a 90 number, he's playing on the D line. You got to really, it just puts an extra layer of studying in. You've been playing with a lot of different guys, a lot of teammates that you've been here. What's the feeling like heading this season? What's around you? Uh, the team that's built, that's right, you're excited. I mean, you're trying to go out there. It's your first time getting everybody out there in your first um, home game, to putting out for the fans. And it's exciting for us. We want to see what we're capable of. Seeing how all, everything we've poured into the offseason and camp, we went, we're ready to see it to come to life. That said, is there a little bit more of a pressure this first game, set the tone, the start of the season? Uh, we're always ready. Uh, first game, we're excited. We're like kids on the first day of school. We want to go. We're excited um, just to go out there and execute because it's the first time to play in a whole game and just get back out there with the guys. I don't know if you remember what it was like running out there in the first home game last year against Jacksonville when there were no fans. I remember it was just something. Yeah. The difference that it's going to be this time, can you yeah. imagine that? We're so excited. Um, the fans bring so much juice, so much excitement to the games, and getting to start it back off in Nissan Stadium, we're excited to bring it to them. Our fans have been great, and I know they'll bring that energy on Sunday. Do you feel like you won't tell us who's starting our team is? How confident are you guys, the other four you guys? As to whoever it is, we'll get the job done. Right. Um, that's what we, we go out there and execute every day. Um, that's what camp's about is building relationships with multiple guys because this is a league that everybody's going to get banged up at some point. So no matter who's in there, you can look at last year, we had multiple guys play multiple positions, and we were still effective. So whoever's out there, they trust, and we trust as offensive line, we're going to get the job done. And do you feel like you've got enough work this preseason to be ready like you want to be? Yeah, it's always, you're always worrying about that. Um, this is, I can count on um, one hand, how many days I've missed in nine years, and this year that's not the case. But I know mentally and physically, um, I'm gonna go out there and try to yeah. do whatever it takes to win this, no matter what. You guys got a lot of veterans on that side of the ball, but a lot of guys didn't miss time this preseason. Right. You do have some experience now trying to get on the same page real quick. Right. Um, we're still in meetings. We're still executing. Now it's going out there and doing the physical part and making adjustments on the field, where it brings some. When you have veterans out there, you're able to make in-game correction. So hopefully everything runs smooth and we're looking forward to Sunday. Rabel and Tannehill both talked about this week there may be more adjustments than usual because it's week one, but right. also Watt and Collins, you've never seen play for the Cardinals before. What right. does that do for you as someone who calls out protection calls? Which is like that right, um, you're making corrections on the sidelines. You're always adjusting. Um, you got to be a coach in the field. I know one of my roles in Tannehill, we got to make adjustments and, and fix it then and not wait to the sidelines. So we got to go out there because they can line up in anything. Um, Preseason is about seeing what guys can play. Um, it's usually not about scheme. So, we're, yes, we're going to see something we haven't seen before.